I don't think we should make such a big deal about it, frankly. I think there are other, th- other more important things that we as church have must be, cons- must be conscious about. What happened was that the the, 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 the Latin text was, or it was changed around 2000. And Pope John Paul wanted a literal translation of the Latin text, okay? And so then, for, for, for I think there was a couple of committees that drew up, that drew up a provisional translation. And then all the national conferences of bishops throughout the world of English-speaking countries, like England, Ireland, uh, I think India, or Australia, New Zealand, Canada, the United States, they all had to approve the translations. And it took quite a while for them to do that. First, I think they approved the, you know, the, the parts of the Mass that don't change. And then they, 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 they uh, went to other, uh, the other translations of other prayers you know, that vary from day to day. Then that had to be get recognition, they call recognitio, by the Holy See. And that, that, I think, came a couple of years ago. And then they said each national conference of bishops could decide when they will take effect in their own country. And uh, for the United States, which it took effect on the first Sunday of Advent. I think this, the whole translation is a minor matter, you know.